Hello friends, this is your friend Aditya aka The Razor Guy and today I'm gonna teach you all how to update your Motorola Razor to official Britain ICS. So let's get started. So before following the video, let me tell you what this video will basically teach you all. This video will not only help you to update your razor to official ICS but will also help you to unbreak your device. What I am trying to say is that along with updating your razor to ICS, you will also learn how to unbreak your device. This means that the updating method and the unbreaking method both are same. So in case your razor goes bad or any damage occurs to your razor, you can recover your device using this method and when you recover your device using this method you will directly come back to official ICS now this official ICS is actually Britain ICS so it is safe for European and Britain users to flash now people living in other regions may be wondering how do I put this in my device don't worry I'll make a thread in which I'll give you a detailed I'll give you detailed instructions on how to install the official ICS of your region on your razor. So just follow the thread and follow the instructions given on the thread. Most probably the method will remain the same however the files which you will flash will be different. Now in order to update your device to ICS let me tell you the pre-requirements that you need. First of all the most important pre-requirement is that you need to have a good battery life. I recommend you guys charging till 80% or so. Then the next thing which you need to do is make sure that your device is not rooted, is completely running on stock ICS. For that I recommend you to reflash your gingerbread file, gingerbread fastboot files so that you are back on completely stock ICS, stock gingerbread and not running rooted razor. And the third thing which you need to make sure is that you have all the necessary files downloaded on your desktop. The link to download all the files is given in the description. After you have got all these files, you can start following the video. So guys, before doing anything, the first thing which you do is that download the official ICS file, OTA file and copy this OTA file in your external SD card of the device. After you have copied the official ICS OTA on your external SD card, you simply disconnect your device and then follow the video. So after you have downloaded the following two files from the link, the next thing which you need to do is that get the system underscore sign file. To get that, what you first need to do is download the 2.3.6 generated fastboot files of the Motorola Razor. Then, after you have downloaded the fastboot files of the gingerbread, just simply make a folder on your desktop saying ROM and extract the fastboot files 
in that rom folder after you extract the password file of the gingerbread in that rom folder you will find a file called system underscore sign so simply take out this file and copy it on your desktop since i have already done this i am not downloading the password files and showing showing it to you guys after you have done that just simply extract the eternity project flash it razor windows file which you downloaded on your desktop then you will get a folder saying eternity project flash it simply open this folder copy all the files and paste them on your desktop now rearrange the files so that you have got all these six files together so after you've done the following things on the desktop the next thing which you need to do is that boot your razor into ap fast boot mode before doing that let me show you the current rom current system version and the rom which i'm running on my device in case if you guys are wondering here you can see that i am running the alpha version of the jelly bean on my razor now you need to boot your device into ap fast boot mode to do that just simply switch off your device then hold volume down volume up and the power button all three together at the same time then you will get a screen like this and go to the third option which says ap fast boot mode scroll down using the volume down button and then select ap fast boot mode using the volume up button then once your device is in ap fast boot mode just connect it via usb to the pc oops my bad now after you have connected your razor to the desktop while the razor is in ap fast boot mode the next thing which you need to do is that open command prompt window on your desktop then you need to paste in three codes copy the first code and paste it in cmd after pasting it hit enter then copy the second code paste it in cmd then hit enter now copy the last code paste it in cmd and hit enter now since this is the biggest file of all the three files it will take around 5 to 10 minutes to flash so just wait patiently
Now after all the files have been flashed, just disconnect your razor, then force power down your device holding the volume down and the power button at the same time for 10 seconds. Then quickly press volume down volume up and the power button at the same time to get back into this screen and then go down to the second option which says recovery and enter into the recovery. Now once you are inside the recovery, you will see a screen like this. To see the instructions, just simply hit the volume down and the volume up button at the same time. Now when you are at this screen, just simply go down to wipe cache partition using the volume down button and select it using the power button and wipe your cache. When your cache is wiped, the next thing which you need to do is that go into apply update from external storage then choose this blur underscore version 651.167.26 xt910.retail.en.eu.zip this is the ICS OTA which you downloaded earlier in the video and put in your external SD card select this file and wait for the installation to be done the installation takes about 10 to 15 minutes, so just wait patiently. And when your device will reboot, it will reboot directly into ICS. So I hope you guys liked my video. Please comment and subscribe. Thank you.